All right, Coach, uh, two wins today. Uh, how, how important are these games for Sabino's program? Um, I mean, coming up here to Phoenix and being a 3A school, playing some of these schools up here, the wins are nice, yeah. but I don't put a lot of stock in these, these games, to be honest. Um, for us, we got kids who play at a high level all through the summer, and we haven't really done much this summer. If people knew we've only been had like five practices and only two days of putting in plays, mm -hmm. then you'll kind of understand the, the method to the madness. I just need my kids to get out here and compete right. and run up and down the floor. Get used to being with each other again. Right. But the season is so far away, mm -hmm. um, it's it's... It's an opportunity for us to be together. That's mm -hmm. that's one of the biggest things. So. Yeah, because most of them are playing club ball yes. on their own, right? Yeah. Yes. So you think for Sabino last year we played, what, 30 games? Mm -hmm. And straight out of February, club kicked in. That was another 15, 20 games. Mm -hmm. Then you get to June, and all we've been doing is lifting and shooting, um, trying to let the kids rest their bodies. Because with Kaya, with West Coast Premier, mm -hmm. they're going to play another 15 games in July. Right. Um, the cameras are going to play another 15 games in July. Mm -hmm. There's so many games going on that they have to have time to get their bodies back together. Now, mm -hmm. you can tell, as you saw the first game, we're super out of shape. Mm -hmm. But but that's fine. Yeah. Because it's June. Right. We need to be ready to go come February. Mm -hmm. So, not... While I like it for the camaraderie, I don't put a lot of stock into this because the summertime they need to rest their bodies a little bit and, and, and continue to develop in the game. Right. But you still want to win this tournament, though, right? Um, you know what? I didn't even know it was a tournament. I oh. thought it was three games. Oh, okay. I didn't know it was a tournament until just, just now. I yeah. thought it was Play three, three, three games. Yeah. Uh, that third game would be based on who won and who lost, and mm -hmm. that would be it. I didn't mm -hmm. know that there was a championship for this. Mm -hmm. So... I would have prepared a little differently if I had known that, but at the end of the day, like the kids get a chance to play together. Yeah. So. And I, I guess Kaya won't be able to play in the same game if he. Yeah, because gets we thought it was gonna yeah. be over. She yeah. has to fly out to California yeah. to get ready for club. Right. And we'll shut it down after this, so all the kids can rest and get ready for to finish out club season. Mm -hmm. Are you guys gonna be on a mission this year for oh. you know what happened last year and all that? Keep that same energy. Yeah. Everybody who had something to say, like we were. The worst guys on the planet, the worst program, keep that same energy. Because yeah. with the young lady who was who were, who was affected most mm -hmm. while she was there, we were 10 and 0 in the regular season. Mm -hmm. After they deemed her ineligible, we were 10 and 0 in the regular right. season. Yeah. So you look at that, and we have the same group of kids coming back. Um, I think the transfer from Tank Verde, Ellaberg, her toughness is going to be mm -hmm. huge for us mm -hmm. with with what we have. So, yeah. Look, right. look, Chip. Right, look, Coach. Chip. All right, I appreciate it. Best Thanks, of luck sir. to you.